much more stylish than yours. Where is your science now? Ah, ah, ah. Oh, oh, look at that, it's adorable. Greetings, senseless people and surrounded by freaks, and welcome back to Jalopy. I think it's called like that, considering that I just checked on Google Translate and it said it like that. Anyway, last episode, we pimped our ride. Our automobile Werk Zwickau Trabant with Uncle Xebet. I should stop calling it like that. And uh, I chose uh, uh, continue and uh, it didn't start when where we left off, considering that Uncle was already in the car. Good morning, uh, Uncle Lutfi. So, shall we give our journey another try today? We didn't even try. Take Uncle, I can even say no, don't come with me. Well, yes, I didn't even start it, but I suppose that this is uh, the normal procedure uh, uh, if uh, you load the game uh, or if you fail uh, the game, uh, which I'm not sure how it works. Uh, maybe the car just breaks down. Anyway, I noticed one thing. There is a lot more stuff uh, in, uh, in our garage now. Like, all the stuff that we used to rebuild uh, the Trabant uh, is now... De but I still have... Uh, the stuff uh, that I put in the trunk uh, the previous episode. So, uh, uh, oh, someone is going to cheat, Uncle. Apparently, when you restart uh, the game, well, not restart, but when you leave the game and then uh, you uh, load it, uh, all the stuff respawns. And so, I'll take advantage of this. Thank you very much. I know this is, doesn't sound very correct to do. But then again, I know that this is uh, quite a difficult game, so let me just take advantage of this. Uh, I suppose a wheel is uh, always good. Aha, I put it there. Can I put anything else? Oh! Well, bucket and sponge. Why? To wash my car? Decal remover. Removes any decal from the car. What does it even mean? Can I put decals on my car? Can I make it even more pimping? other than with the red door. This should be like a generic toolbox, so I will definitely put it there. I think, though, that uh, your car will get heavier with all this stuff. Well, I don't know what to do with it. Uh, it doesn't really let me open it or anything. We don't have enough reputation among uh, uh, East German tuners. I suppose that for now it's not u useful. And uh, this time we're ready to go, my dear uncle. Do I have to choose? Uh, the keys are just above you in the sun visor. Oh, nice. Do I still have uh, uh, to follow the route that we chose last time? Probably, considering that he's not telling me anything else. Ah, uh, I see. So they're not the same routes from last time. I remember that we chose route 2 because it was the best one. This time, uh, either 1 or 2. So let's go for route 1. Still Berlin to Dresden. There we go. Wow, it slammed in my face. Are we ready to go, uncle? Can I... Aha! Look this acceleration, uncle. And so begins our journey. Nice. Head towards Dresden. This game doesn't have much uh, um, music, soundtrack. But I see here a nice... Uh... It sounds quite weird and my car is going very slowly. What? What speed is that? 40 kilometers per hour? Uh, this uh, music station sucks, uncle. I think I'll just turn it off. Anyway, this is East German, isn't it? 99 red balloons floating in the summer sky. Da -da 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 -da. Didn't you know that that song from Goldfinger is actually... Of course you don't know that song from Goldfinger because you're not as old as I am, but... It's actually a cover from a German band that uh, was singing about a concert in, uh, in Berlin with uh, red balloons floating into East Berlin. Oh, a tank! Nice. Can we just get the tank? I mean, it's... Uh, probably... Oh! The hell is that? Nice carbon color over there. Don't you want to try the tank, uncle? We can pimp the tank. Would be nice. Anyway! I remind you that we're... Shut the hell up! 
What the hell do you want? Fine, I'll go on this uh, stupid uh, lane and you pass me. Uncle, our car sucks. It's so slow. I remind you that me and Uncle are running away from something or someone. Mafia stuff. You know, it's a curious feeling running away and stealing everything from your former workplace. Being on the road again. On the road again. After such a long time. All those years in the, in the GDR. Oh god. Oh god, this is... The car is really struggling to go up this hill. We're barely 20 kilometers per hour. Oh dear. I know that in this uh, game uh, you can find uh, some uh, boxes or some items on the side of the road. Uh, I've read it. Uh, oh. Well, pass me if you can! Ha! Ha! What if I stay in the middle of the road? What you gonna do? They can give you items uh, that you can sell. I've read this because uh, it's a rather important part of the game. I know I wasn't born there, but I found... Oh, oh there it is. There it is one. But I found a belonging I've not experienced at any other time in my life. So where are you from, uncle? Huh? Are you an illegal immigrant? Paper, please, uh, just became this game. Huh? Are we going back to your hometown? Oh, you just stopped. What the hell? Can't you pass? Look! Pass here! I just have to collect that box. The hell do you want? Huh? You have a problem with me? Huh? Huh? Let me look in your face. Here we have Ned Flanders from The Simpsons. What kind of car do you have? This, this looks like uh, a Lada. Some kind of a Lada. It's a Russian uh, car. Can I steal from your... <laughs> no, I can't. There is a box here, though, that we cannot open because uh, it has a lock. But I suppose we might uh, take it with us if uh, there is even space in our trunk. Is there space? C can't you just drive around instead of just... Uh... Oh, shit! <laughs> Can you hear this? <laughs> Road rage! <laughs> I'll demolish your car, bitch. Problem, Ned Flanders. Problem. Anyway, let's try. Uh, will it fit? Oh! Oh, okay. It's kind of floating, but it fits. No, my car is even heavy. Problem? Problem? Huh? How heavy am I? And am I made of metal? Yes, yes, I'm going. Uh, stupid idiot. No, I didn't mean... <laughs> or maybe I'm not. What do you want? Huh? Problem. Okay. Let's stop messing around. The road to Dresden is long. So, as far as I know, there are two types of uh, uh, boxes or items that you can find on the side of the road. One is a box uh, that we just found with uh, a lock. So we cannot open it without uh, some kind of a tool. And then we can find a box with tape on it, and that we can open it directly and see what's inside. Well, with the wall down, it shouldn't be long to s till we see reunification. Up! Oh! What? What the hell? What's wrong with you? You damaged my car! You bitch! Look at him, he's clearly drunk! I mean, I cannot complain, considering that I waste this car quite a bit. We can get to a petrol station if we turn off here. Hmm, should we? Let's do it. Well, we are halfway with um, with the fuel tank, so... Let's just uh, stop here. Maybe we can uh, do something about the fact that they just uh, hit my car from behind. I mean, I usually like being hit from behind, but not in this case. Okay, considering that I have to pour it uh, in the in the bonnet, uh, it's the case to stop uh, here. Happy now, uncle? Let me see the damage uh, from behind. Uh, stupid idiots. Well, it doesn't look like uh, there is uh, damage, actually. 909 Luft balloons. I suppose uh, we go... Yeah, 5 out of 10. Uh, yes, I would say full. Full. 
we all oh, right uh, but if i put more fuel i also have to put more oil but luckily thanks to my cheating Celtic viking pirate i have uh, two oil here <laughs> oh it's already sunset how long have we been traveling well for sure going 40 kilometers per hour lean oil mix i wonder if i can sell it hmm let's try can you imagine going in a gas station? Yeah, I have this empty oil can, uh, you know, I'd like to sell it. Hey there, you look a little lost. Not really, what's your problem? Just pick whatever you need off the shelves and place it through this window. Three marks or whatever this is. So, I can buy sausages, two stroke oil. Well, mm, I wonder if I should get another one. It's water. Tires, uh, we cannot bring any more tires. Uh, a tire repair kit, uh, nice. Uh, engine repair kit. Uh, also, if uh, I have a flat tire, I cannot repair it with the one that I have. Uh, so probably a tire repair kit uh, will be useful. Uh, oh, crowbar. Used to open locked crates. Yes, I clearly need this one. It's 30 marks though. Here we have medicine. Oh, so we have to take care of, of, the, of ourselves as well? This is not going to be nice. Uncle, you better not get uh, sick. Uh, medicine. I wonder if I can steal stuff. <laughs> this is coffee beans. So why would I need it? Tobacco. Oh, buy value is only five. Nice. Uh, well, well, well. Uh, well, if I have uh, space uh, in, the, in the trunk, uh, I might as well get it. Don't worry, Uncle, we're just having a little bit of a pit stop. It's lasting hours, I know. Yeah, I'll put 99 Red Balloons on the radio. It's the only uh, song that uh, we, we are allowed to listen. Oh, now it's optimal. Great. Now, Uncle, don't steal my car while I'm paying, all right? It's my car now. You're pimping enough with that kind of jacket. And yes, now I have 71, but I have a crowbar. First, I should be able with a crowbar. Tell me it works like this. No, why doesn't it work? Oh, you have to, you know, insist. There was only one, <laughs> like, few sausages called the Wurst. I don't think it's going to give me much money at all. Oh, amazing. I like how when you pick up the wrong thing and you just drop it, it flies back there. Because you cannot lose your passport. <laughs> anyway. I suppose that with 71, and we will get a little bit more here, we can buy also the tire repair kit, if it fits in our car, hopefully. Yeah, it's five. Fair enough, it's a good price. Where is the other one? Where is my wallet? My wallet disappeared! What the hell? Is it back in my car? Uncle! I am sick of your uh, sorceries. Where is it? It's here! What the hell? The wallet will go back magically there. Wait, but does it fit? Oh, it's very small! Yes, it does fit! What the hell? It's so small! It looks so big! Close the door for you, uh, Uncle, because you do shit. And we are ready to go again! Nice! We are ready. Things are going good. Things are going good. Can I uh, turn on the lights? Oh, this one! Aha! Here I am. Okay, let's try not to smash the car against anything. This gas station is not very well made, it's quite tight. I mean, I have a Trabant, which is a rather small car. I can't imagine if you have a Mercedes or something like that. But here we are on the road again. What? But my car just started... What? We just left the freaking uh, gas station and my car started smoking. C couldn't you smoke before? I guess... Uh, I don't know how far away is Dresden. But when we will arrive there, I will have to check. Oh, another... No, Zastava! You won't pass me! You won't pass me this time! Aha! Uh -huh. Yes, yes. I have a damaged car, but with the hell that you will pass me? Thought so, Zastava. Thought so. And I'm going very fast now, what the hell? Look at... Oh, nice, 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 nice. Let's stop in the middle of the road. 100 almost. Oh, pass me then. Fine then. Don't mind me. I just stopped in the middle of uh, the highway. Fine, fine. I wonder if you can... Can you run me? Oh, shit! <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> oh, my.
my god! <laughs> Can I just pick this up? Oh, this one has uh, tape on it, so... <laughs> I was like, I ain't going to stop with this idiot! <laughs> Thank you. Hey! Okay, that's in the other one. What? There's nothing here? Uh, thanks for nothing. Come on. It's weird, though, that we have only former Soviet, you know, uh, block uh, cars. Oh my god, that scared me. Yes, I know that East Germany was a very, quite repressive uh, uh, government. But still, uh, it's 1990, so there should be a bit more freedom. One thing thought me. No good comes from involving yourself in political opposition. Life becomes much more bearable when you accept the flow of things. I've seen too many become pawns of extremist ideals. Why are we talking about that, that uncle? This is supposed to be a fun game. Oh, 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 two boxes! Very nice. Let's stop here. Let's stop here. And I can turn off... Alright, here we have one that has a lock, and here we have one that has a lock. Get my trusty crowbar and go open this box. I really hope that it doesn't break. Oh, wine! Cell value 33.5! That's a lot! Mine, mine. Oh, I can grab the other one. Nice, please, please fit, because I really need it. One, two... Can I get also this one? Come on! I am going to be rich, I am going to be rich! 33... I don't know what kind of items you can find in these boxes, but considering that uh, I found earlier sausages that were like one mark, and this is 33, that's quite a lot! Come on! Open it! What's this? Textiles... Oh yeah, you see? Textiles, it's only uh, 1.6 marks! So, yeah, I don't think it will add much weight to the car, but no, 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 I don't have space. I don't have space for them. Oh, well, I will leave them. Okay, let, let's be good citizens and don't leave it in the middle of the road. Why there are so many things uh, on the side of the road anyway? It looks like we are scavengers in some kind of game like, oh shit, in some kind of games like uh, DayZ or, well, it's much better than DayZ, let's be honest. Yeah, well, three bottles of wine uh, uh, added quite a lot of weight to my car, apparently. Now it's struggle to be at 40. Come on, baby, come on, we can make it to Dresden. Anyway, there's Dresden ahead, nice! Uh, we're actually there, uh, and, well, our car is not faring that well, considering there's smoke. Uh, it can be that bad, considering that we have quite some money to spend. Uh. Let's head to the motel, we'll have to cross the border tomorrow. Yeah, hold my uncle. Let's see where is the motel. It's quite an ominous sight, this kind of uh, walls. No cars whatsoever around here. Oh, this is like... Uh, yeah, I suppose there I can uh, repair my car, maybe. I see uh, the Lada shop. The, sorry, the Leica slash uh, uh, Automobile Werkzvikau. There's the motel, park outside the front. Side where? Oh, there it is. Yeah, I suppose that this is a good place where to end this episode. Happy uncle? I, I wonder if uh, there is a shop uh, in this city, so we can maybe sell uh, stuff uh, tomorrow. Okay, good, let's check in. I wonder if you can steal stuff in this... Uh, in this game. I, I know that my Celtic Viking Pirate-ness uh, is showing. D don't trip into the tables, uncle. Welcome! Will you be staying with us tonight? Yes, I suppose. It's 20 for the room. Yeah, there we go. You'll be staying in room 2B on the second floor. We kindly ask you not to don't disturb the other guests during your stay. Alright, alright! I, I watch you. Don't steal my ping ping trabant. Don't you dare. I suppose that we're going to sleep, but uh, I see that uh, there are some rooms maybe I could, uh, you know, try to loot a bit here and there. If you know what I'm saying, uncle. Why don't I have the keys? I didn't grab them. Hi again. <laughs> Hi again, you idiot. You didn't grab the keys. <sighs> here I am, uncle. See? I have the keys, I'm actually not that stupid after all. Oh, whoa! Surely are eager to sleep, huh? 
Well, 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 well. There's still some time for you to see the town. You could visit the market to trade or upgrade a car at the Traban dealership. Just use the bed when you're done for the day and we can get some sleep. Anyway, I'm exhausted. Time for bed. Okay, uncle. <laughs> you sleep like that? Oh, what? You sleep like that? With... Uh... Whoa! First of all, why are you sleeping on the, on the edge of the bed like that? Second, why are you sleeping with the suitcase in your hands like that? Third, who opened the suitcase? Fourth, uh, Berlin, 89. Are we going to read into Uncle's stuff? In response to your request for the acquisition of one uh, Trabant motor vehicle for the purpose of uh, transportation of personal property to be returned to their country of origin, Place on the date uh, whatever, 1986, uh, we can now inform you that we are unable to approve or support uh, this request uh, on the grounds that government vehicles are not to be used in the transportation of private property, especially to countries outside of uh, fraternal socialist observation. Hmm... Furthermore, we are compelled to remind you that all communications with countries outside the state's sphere of influence are truthfully monitored, and as such, we must ask all comrades exercise constant vigilance with regards to any delicate information they might find themselves in possession of. So, it almost sounds like the Trabant that we are driving was a former government vehicle that, that sounds weird, they had tra normal Trabans as government vehicles in East Germany, but the letter says that uh, the government denied uh, him uh, the car uh, to, for personal use, uh, and also because uh, he wants to go back to his uh, country of origin, uh, which is outside of uh, the socialist uh, whatever it was. Uh, the last destination is Turkey, which was outside of the socialist uh, sphere, because it's even outside of Europe, it's in Asia. It might be that our uncle is originally from Turkey, but also, if they deny the car to him, how is that we are driving it? Or maybe they denied the Trabant to him, so he just found a scrapped, uh, half-destroyed Trabant, is that why? Uncle, you're shady. So let's have a nice sleep. Ah, uh, the sight of uh, that amazing jacket will give me nice dreams. Day one, Dresden. <gasps> Uncle is gone! He's stealing my Trabant! So I'll end this episode here. Next episode we will probably do some shopping around Dre- Oh ho 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 ho! Nice! Uh, these beds uh, are fake. These beds are a lie. Uh, we will probably do some shopping around Dresden, probably sell some stuff, uh, steal some stuff as well, well, I mean what? And also repair our car, maybe modify it a bit more. So, I hope you like it and surrounded by freaks. This is all, see you next time, bye bye!